So my Altered Magazine holder is all done. I got these from the dollar store. They come two in a pack. And um, they're really great. They're very, very sturdy. They're made out of cardboard. Um, but if you didn't have these, then what you could do is just take an old cereal box and just cut um, a diagonal cut off, you know, the square part. And then um, you'd have a magazine holder that way too. But I really love the way it turned out. Um, I did decoupage the bottom. But there's some edges here that I need to add some more decoupage glue to um, that came up when I was folding it. So I'll do that. But I really love the way it turned out. And it has so much color and texture and fabulousness. So I love it. And I did brush the whole thing with my decoupage glossy medium. Um, I just love beautiful shiny things. <laughs> okay. I'm going to take it and definitely I need to wait for it to dry a little bit more. But you just put it in there. And you stick your magazine in there, and you're all ready to go. So isn't that fun? How oh, cool. It's a little bit way down on one side, but that's okay. This table is not exactly equal, but I'll keep messing with it, and it'll work. But this was so much fun to make. I really enjoyed it. I, paint the, I painted the whole thing inside. I don't know if you can see that. Um, this antique gold, which I love. There are some spots, you know, that can be touched up a little bit, but... I don't mind. I just really enjoy this project. And I did get to use my China um, pen, which is fun, um, in white, which is great. And those are permanent too. And China pens are only like a buck fifty at Michael's. So I would go out and grab a couple of those. They're really fun. If you can't find the Stabilo All, then a China pen is really cool to use too. And it gives you kind of the same effect. It gives you kind of that, but it's really, it really pushes things out. Um, and you can kind of blend it in. They're really fun to have. But I really enjoyed this project. If you guys have any questions, let me know. And I will see you next time. Don't forget me to give me a thumbs up and to like and subscribe. And I will see you next time. Bye-bye. Have a great day.